Hello, welcome back to my channel and this is Tom. Hi, sorry about that, I've already recorded this and then I realised I didn't have my mic set up properly and my mic sounded like I'd been talking through a cardboard box or something, it was ridiculously muffled. Turns out it was just some weird window setting that sets your microphone to complete rubbish. Anyway, welcome back to my channel, I don't need these anymore. <laughs> oh, it feels so much better. Anyway. Welcome back to my channel and today we are talking about the, well it's halfway through my year two of Open University so that's what I thought about talking about today because a lot of my viewers tend to come from my Open University videos so I presume a lot of my people that are viewing my videos are, well, that are subscribed are also looking for Open University videos. So this is to you guys, this is halfway through my year two, um, I'm doing four units uh, for four modules, whatever you want to call it. I'm doing my maths from the first year because I left it to the last minute in my first year so I understand nothing when it came to one of my TMAs so I had to postpone it. And then I'm doing web technologies I believe it's called. It's all about understanding the web, um, understanding how it works, the servers, you look at coding in Java, Script and PHP. Um, I think that's what you use primarily. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Anyway, you do that and then you do, I'm doing networking, which is through Cisco. Um, Cisco is a recognised brand in networking. They do, they manufacture a lot of networking equipment and they also do this online ac academy type thing, which can do separately. You don't have to do that through Open University, but obviously if you study the module in Open University, it's paid for by the Open University and you get access through Open University. So um, yeah, that's what I'm doing for that. And then last one is like part two of this one that you do in the first year. For the life of me, I cannot remember what it's called, but it's like a core ICT unit. Like if you do computing and IT, you have to, you have to study this course. It's like um, this year in block one, you do about mobile data and stuff and radio waves and stuff like that and then in block two which is what i'm doing now i'm going towards the end in like two weeks or so um it's about it's more of a team working one uh it's just pretty it's pretty it's pretty simple if your team gets on i suppose um you build this basic website through wordpress uh you create a storyboard um uh, of additional parts of the website you would build that you can't necessarily well not easily be build through wordpress and then you evaluate another group's work you do that in like a group of five um but yeah it's pretty good we talk regularly online through like the student-led group that you can talk to you can do like a live chat and stuff like that so we talk through that like a couple of times a week and um, yeah so far so good so that's the four modules i'm doing um I just want to apologise as well, sorry to just like jump in there, but I just want to apologise because it's been like six, seven months or something like that since I last uploaded a video. I do apologise, um, I just, I don't know, I didn't want to make a video for the sake of making a video and then I got caught up in other things, but since I last made a video I got a proper light, which you can probably tell it's kind of bright actually. Um, and I keep looking at it, not looking at the camera because I can barely see the camera lens. I can just see this bright as hell light. But um, yeah, maybe I'll work on that in the future. Um, but yeah, got a proper camera light. Um, got a new computer. So my uh, before I was on my laptop, which I've just given me with half. Um, and the laptop, although it's it's pretty good, it gets the job done. It, it was kind of slow. Um, so got a new computer. Just need to get a GPU for that. Um, because at the moment I'm running on just my processor, which I know if you if you're into computers, people will be like, "What the hell are you doing, man? Why are you just on a processor? <laughs> That's mad." But um, it, it's honestly just the processor is kind of better than my old laptop, apart from gaming, because um, my old laptop had a, de a designated GPU, um, so it's I supposed to integrate a GPU like on my processor. But anyway, yes. Uh, I'll stop talking for anyone that doesn't care about computers now. Um, but yeah, got the computer, got a, a mic stand, splashed a full £10 on this bad boy and it, it's now actually, my mic is not no longer like 16 feet away from my mouth. Um, 
because with the blue snowball, if uh, which is the one that I'm using. Um, sorry if that was really loud, but with the blue snowball, you get like a little a little stand, and it's like I don't know, like ten centimeters the stand, maybe fifteen centimeters. So although the desk is right in front of me, it would be incredibly low down, and I'd either have to like get really crouch down to it or um, yeah it wouldn't really pick up my voice properly maybe I didn't have the settings sorted for that either but this is miles better anyway because I can just move it wherever just yeah have it, have it above my head for a bit if I want you know so um, yeah let's, let's not let's not though Again, I can tell by audacity that is coming up some weird wave lines, so I apologise if all that was super loud. But uh, yeah, um, I suppose with a cheap mic stand, it's hard to move without the microphone picking up. But yeah, anyway. So yeah, for, uh, back to Open University. My second year is it's this, you get the same like time frame in between TMAs, but the amount of work is greater. Um, it's more intense. You kind of instead of learning a little bit and then using it and then learning a little bit more on it and then using that and then going like a little bit at a time like you might do in the first year um the second year you kind of learn a little bit do something with it and then skip to the next thing <laughs> and then just keep doing it like that it seems to be like that anyway um so it's more like you need to you know, concentrate and be on the ball at all times, otherwise you're just going to be left behind, I feel like. Um, but yeah, it's been good. Um, learned some interesting things, learned some boring things as well, I have to admit. Um, networking at a time was... Some modules are great, and then some modules seem to just go on forever. Um, but that all, and I'm kind of kind of iffy about my PHP coding. Um, it's kind of jumpy, so... I need to work on that for the future. Although I've done the module on PHP coding, um, obviously I need to learn it for the future and stuff. So I need to do a bit more on that in my spare time. I feel like, but other than that, it's been going on fine. Uh, yeah. So uh, if there's any questions, again, um, I do. I've been getting a few comments from people saying that they've enjoyed my last, well, one of my old Open University videos, and want to. Just, you know, said that they have learned stuff or they've asked me a couple of questions on it. Like, one person asked um, why I took the harder maths one, and I was like, well, because I'm an idiot, uh, <laughs> basically. Um, and then some other people said that it was good to, I got they got some information from it, and they're looking into Open University, so it was helpful. So I just want to say thank you for anyone who found anything helpful in those videos because no chance I, well, probably I just mumbled like I do in every video and to know that at least even a couple of people got something from it then that's great that's really nice to know so thank you guys for commenting away and watching my videos basically if you do have any questions feel free to comment on any of my videos or dm me on instagram and twitter um, my dms are my, i have to i have to accept your dms but my dms are open to anyone can dm me i just have to accept you if i'm not following you or whatever so yeah, um, feel free to DM me on Twitter, Instagram, or comment, whichever. I reply to my comments like as quick as I can, usually, usually the same day. Um, and and I'm always on Instagram and Twitter, so yeah, feel free. Um, my Twitter has changed. If you followed me, well, no, if you followed me already on Twitter, then you'd you'd follow me anyway. But my Twitter has changed. It's now it's not Waggy Seven and Nine because I felt like that was quite almost unprofessional. It was my the high school username was well nickname was waggy um born 27th and 9th that's where the 2709 comes from uh, but i changed that to tom wagstaff prod uh because tom wagstaff was taken on everything and so it was like tom underscore wagstaff and all that stuff so tom wagstaff prod which is productions but productions was too long for instagram i think or twitter one of the two but yeah tom wagstaff prod on twitter and instagram feel free say hi me a follow <laughs> and if you enjoyed this video thank you very much and please like the video if you can subscribe that'd be great like i said comment any questions um if i get a few questions i might do a video on it but chance i'll just respond to you in the comments anyway so feel free to comment on me on my videos any video i don't mind and i will see you guys in a bit peace